Sensei, any word on Tomoe? Yes, but I'm not sure you are ready for her. You make her sound like a demon. That's not far off the mark. Tomoe is fearless. She is not samurai, but she is a born killer. I know the type. No, you do not. You said the only way up was to climb. No, I said you had to climb. It's good exercise. Arrows, Mongol and Japanese. If they were here, they're long gone. We might pick up their trail by the practice target. There is no target. Near that watchtower. Not bad, Sensei. Find out where they went. You knew those Mongols were still here? Yes. You didn't think to mention it? If you can't handle a few Mongols, what good will you be against Tomoe? This is war, not a test. And how many wars have you fought? I'll test you as I see fit. I can see why Tomoe attacked you. <laughs> Look at them. They're practicing what Tomoe taught them. Murdering the innocent. Did you see a Japanese woman with these Mongols? I couldn't believe it. She was giving them orders. What did she say? Something about the sensei. And the hot springs. That's all I heard, my lord. Forgive me. I taught a monster how to hunt. They heard Tomoe giving orders to the Mongols. She mentioned Hiyoshi Springs. She's just getting started. Sakai, the way you fight, it's not your uncle's way, and it's not mine. We've never faced an enemy like this. I do what I must to defeat them. A samurai is a guardian, not a killer who darts around like a thief. You didn't see Komodo. I've seen enough! I know it was brutal, but I won't train another monster. I know. I won't let that happen. If Tomoe is going after Yoshi Springs, I need to prepare. So do you. I'll see you at my dojo, Sakai. Any news of Tomoe? Travelers have been shot dead on the roads in and out of Yoshi Springs. People are afraid to leave. Or deliver supplies. You think that's our doing? Hmm. A few archers, a strategic points, can isolate a whole town. A tactic of yours when you were Clan Nagao's archery master. Tomoe was a good student. Too good. We're fighting your own reflection. We will turn that to our advantage. Tensei Ishikawa! You know the name Ishikawa? I do. I have message. Speak. Sensei, all of Hiyoshi Springs will beg for mercy, like the victims of Hironori Naga. Silence! <laughs> Hironori Nagao. Didn't he die fighting bandits? It was decades ago. He was reputed to be a great archer. Did he study with you? No. Tomoe is spreading lies. But there's a seed of truth. She wants us to doubt each other. We are all that stands between Hiyoshi Springs and a bloodbath. Then we stand together. Hmm. We'll plan the town's defense at my dojo. Meet me there and be ready to fight. We must deal with Tomoe's threat against Hiyoshi Springs before it's too late. I don't understand the fixation on the town. I was born there. Destroying it proves her worth to the Mongols. And humiliates me. But the terrain works in our favor. Two skilled archers can hold off hundreds. Or we allow the Mongols to take it. Tomoe wins a victory and lets her guard down. Then we strike. Sacrifice Hiyoshi Springs for Tomoe. The sacrifice is worth it. Tomoe would agree, Sensei. Finds a guy. She will attack from the north. We should focus our efforts there. 
Scout elevated positions, place arrows, and... Listen! Did you hear that? If the point was to kill us, she would have sent more men. Or the point was not to kill, but to delay. Hyoshi Springs. The attack is starting. Mongols are heading for Hyoshi Springs. Gather everyone at the inn and stay out of sight. We will deal with them. Yes, my lords. There she is. That's Tomoe? Burning the Nagao banner. We can catch her. Oh, she'll be long gone by the time we get there. She's a coward. No. She's mocking me. She knows the last student I trained before her was Hironori Nagao. You said he wasn't your student. Which is it? I was young, prideful, callous. Hironori learned from my example. He led a rebellion to seize the clan and lost, but only after butchering Lord Nagao's best men. Hironori didn't die fighting bandits. That was a story to protect Nagao's legacy. There was no saving mine. As his teacher, I could never be trusted again. I was granted the mercy to resign my position. I convinced myself the way of the bow had to survive. But the truth is, I am a coward who should have ended it long ago. You told Tomoe all of this. I wanted her to understand what it meant for me to teach again. But like everything else, she turned it against me. You'll never redeem Hironori Nago. And you won't change Tomoe. But today, you saved the people of Hiyoshi Springs. With my new student. I'll need you at Castle Canada. My bow is yours. But Tomoe isn't done yet. We must keep hunting her. We will, Sensei. I'm looking for a samurai, an archer. The Sensei headed toward the coast. He said you should catch up with him to join the hunt. And you'd know what that meant. <sighs> they had you surrounded. Tomoe taught them well. That's not why they outmaneuvered you. If you have an insight, share it. You didn't notice them because you were too focused on finding Tomoe. Even I make mistakes, Sakai. No, you don't. Except with her. Hmm. We should get moving. I gave her everything, and she threw it away. She's a threat. There is only one way this ends. I know what must be done. Knowing and doing are different. You are questioning whether I am samurai? Don't worry. It was my greatest achievement. But if I must, I will destroy her to save this island. That is my duty. The list we found. We will use it to track down the other camps. And we will end Tomoe's treachery. Sakai! You are a fine warrior. You could become a great leader. But do not question my integrity again. I'm not a thief. Uh, everyone knows you're attacking caravans. The ghost and the demon Sensei. Sensei Ishikawa? That's a lie. I've heard you myself. Heard us? When? Not long ago. Tearing up the road like starving wolves. What happened here? His caravan was ambushed. Lots of attacks lately. People say you're stealing supplies. 
or sided with the Mongols. Rest easy. I'll discuss this with Lord Sakai. Tomoe is behind this. She sows paranoia and fear. Attacking caravans, blaming us. I caught up to his group too late. Saved him, but not the others. Where was he ambushed? Close. Why? Find the ambush site. Track the rest of Tomoe's group to their camp. That makes sense. What's wrong? Nothing. She has me off balance. We'll put an end to that. It's a warning to the people of Kushi. From Tomoe. From Lord Sakai and Sensei Ishikawa. No travel is permitted on these roads. On pain of death. Crude, but effective. Be free soon. Oh no! No, please! No! We're here to help. She said... She said... Tomoe? What did she say? She said... I could live until the samurai came. No! On the ledge! Tomoe set a trap for us, and we walked right into it. I spoke with her two days ago. Tomoe? The captive. Heard her talking about a Japanese woman she saw with the Mongols. I asked her to find out where they were camped and report back. You talk about what it means to be a warrior, how Tomoe undermines that. But you and she are the same. You expect us to be perfect. Your uncle, me, Masako Adachi. But only a child expects perfection of his elders. Finish your thought, Sensei. We all carry weapons. We all choose between life and death. And you're too comfortable with that power. And if I weren't, I would be dead. And so would you, ghost. Not everyone can be a samurai. But we're all killers. Sensei Ishikawa, is all this Tomoe's work? She and her mongos have been busy. A woman here named Ran knows where to find her. Lead the way. <gasps> yes, my lords. The mongos who did this to you, they were led by one of our own. <laughs> Tomoe, I'll never forget that face. She used to ride with a group of thieves who lived here. That's not possible. Tomoe is from Umugi Prefecture. She found her way here. Her bow terrorized Utsuna for years. People used to say she could knock a falcon from the sky, blindfolded. This camp you found, where is it? The forest, southwest of here. The... Between the river and the western shore. Tomoe never told you any of that. Before we fought, I offered to adopt Tomoe as my daughter. Make her samurai. For someone like her, that's quite a change in fortune. And I took it away. Because she's a hired killer. Because her sensei failed her. She fell back into the life she knew. It's one thing to wreck your chance at a better life, but to terrorize your own people. I am aware, Sakai. Are you? Can I count on you to do what needs to be done? We have a cap to find. Could be Tomoe. The sensei and the ghost. I'm getting tired of you two. Your archers are dead. It's over. Ambush. Go after Tomoe. I'll hold these fools off. Where's he going? Tomoe! So you're old Sakai, the sensei's new pet. And you're a gifted archer who had a chance at a better life. Threw it away. Is that what he told you? Tomoe, why are we talking? So I can warn you to watch your back. My sensei tried to kill me. He'll try the same with you. Thanks for the warning, but I'm here to end this. It's already over. 
I have nothing. No one. Put the bow down, Tomoe. Tomoe could have killed me, but she didn't. You let her get away. She jumped off a cliff. I saw her. You saw what she wanted you to. She sounded desperate. She is. Because of us. Why does she think you'll turn on me? She doesn't. She's trying to drive a wedge between us. And it's working. No. It's not. Good. But the next time you wonder if I can do what's needed, ask yourself first. When I was your age, people said I was the next Tadayori Nagao. You're the best archer we've ever had. Nah, not even close. But I'm damn good. And I'm grateful for everything you taught me. I was so dedicated to my study. I never made time for a family. Tomoe was to be my heir. Her crimes. I could not forgive her. No samurai would. I devoted my life to the bow. The life it gave me was remarkable. But the life it took from me. Family is more important. Sensei? Don't become like me. Don't let the ghost consume you. Hey. Tomoe is somewhere in Kamiyagata. A last-ditch effort to rally the Mongols and restore her reputation. If she's here, we will find her. And end this. Yes, we will. I'll sit over there. Mongol convoy. Wiped out. By who? Burn the cart. Flaming arrows? <gasps> Please, excuse me, my lord. It's a bad idea to sneak up on me. I thought you were with the man who killed these Mongols. He was samurai, but older. An archer? Sensei Ishikawa, where is he? He said he'd come back to my house in a day or two. Why your house? I have food, a fire. Whatever his business was, it seemed urgent. It's possible he picked up Tomoe's trail. Where's your house? Not far, but there's a storm coming, and I need to check my snares first. Then I can take you there. Fine, I'll go with you. What's your name? Matsu, my lord. Damn, empty. Have to reset it. You might have more luck hunting. Oh, I could never do that. So awful. Maybe try a different bait. My bait never changes. What do you use? The illusion of opportunity. There's your problem. That only works on men. Please don't hurt us, my lord! That's not yours. We are sorry. It's just a squirrel. We have eaten grass and tree bark for days. Take it and go. Thank you, my lord. You let them escape! We thought dinner. They were starving. And no threat. Doesn't sound like the ghost I've heard about. Not all the stories about me are true. The blizzard is almost on us. How many more traps do you have? Just one. But it's farther away. Look at this! Dinner! You got something? We might eat like civilized people after all. What's out there? The mainland. No Mongols, no war. Somewhere I can start over. Say you make it to the mainland. What then? In Kyoto, I'll open a fancy inn. Learn to play the shamisen. Welcome the undying parade of beautiful men and women, while my servants rob them blind. Sounds like Kyoto's in trouble. 
You seem too kind to be the ghost. But the way you killed those Mongols... I do what I have to for Tsushima. The truth is, we are both survivors. We have darkness in us. If we didn't, we'd be dead. Sensei Shikawa said something similar. But it sounds more natural coming from you, Tomoe. Ishikawa always said I underestimate my opponents. I don't have an arrow in my back. Why not? The Mongols turned against me. After you trained them to slaughter our people. A mistake I tried to fix. But I can't kill all my archers. Not our own. You need me. And the Sensei. But we don't need you. I know where they'll attack next. We can ambush them together. You get a victory, I get revenge. I'll talk it over with Sensei Shikawa. Jin, you can stay the night. No, Tomoe. I can't. I spoke with Tomoe. She's hiding in the north. The Mongols turned against her. If you saw her, why is she still alive? Her archers are preparing a massive attack. She wants the three of us to wipe them out. Or she needs both our heads to get back in the Mongols' favor. She could have killed me, Sensei, but she didn't. Hmm. I have never been rewarded for trusting Tomoe. I don't trust her. But we need what she knows. And I believe she needs our help. Then she's a fool. And we finish this. You have word from Tomoe? The three of us will meet. Then she'll reveal where and when her archers plan to attack. You think she'll tell us the truth? We'll find out. And Sakai, there will be no room for error. I came prepared, Sensei. Let's go. Always so sure of yourself. The one thing you never had to teach me. Your archers are planning an attack. Where and when? Umugi Cove. Heading there now. Why tell us? The Khan betrayed me. I'm taking my archers away. And if we don't help you stop them, they'll wipe out Umugi Kof. I don't believe you. Do nothing. And watch what happens. Damn it. The Mongols followed me. She fought back against the Mongols, Sensei. To deceive us, so we lower our guard. If I want to put an arrow in you, there's nothing you can do to stop me. Enough! Umugi Cove could be under attack. We need to move. Fine. But if Tomoe even breathes wrong, I'll put her in the dirt. Mongols are out in force. They're hunting me. I thought I lost them. Didn't think to mention that earlier. I'm mentioning it now. Wait here until nightfall. We can use the darkness to our advantage. Will they attack the cove before then? No. They'll position archers. Make sure no one gets out. Plan their slaughter. Get some rest. I'll keep watch. Nobody said this would be easy. We get in a fight here. Your archers will be alerted. Start the attack before we reach the cove. We can't risk it. What do you think, Sakai? Follow my lead. Don't fall behind. Not bad, Sakai. Where's Tomoe? I don't know. Was she wounded? Tomoe! Near the end of the fight, I saw her by the archway over there. That leads straight into Umugi Cove. If any Mongols try to retreat that way... Maybe she gave chase. Wait. Sensei Ishikawa, we have judged each other harshly, but the Buddha tells us that our greatest enemies can be our best teachers. I am grateful for your teaching and for the chance to fight by your side. A final time, I have been your student. I would have become your daughter, but the way of the bow is behind me now. What lies ahead? I am like an arrow shot from a bow. Who knows 
where the wind will take me. It's over. Maybe she'll reach Kyoto after all. If she were anyone else, I'd say that's impossible. We still have a war to finish, a home to rebuild. I have no more lessons to give in this life, except one. Promise me, you won't repeat my mistakes. I promise, Sensei. Lady Masako, do you have news of your family's killers? On the list we found, Sada was at the top. He's the head man of Kuta Farmstead. Kuta's people served your clan. Why would he turn against you? Because he is an ungrateful traitor. My husband appointed Sadao as head man, and he repaid that kindness with bloodshed. I learned he fled Kuta the night my family was murdered. He must have heard you survived. Sadao is a deceitful snake. But his brother, Hachi, is a fool. He just passed by the temple carting food for the refugees. He will make an unscheduled delivery to his brother. And we will be there to catch him. We will promise Sada. Okay. Not yet, but I have something for your guest. It's a meeting. We'll pass it along. He handed them a note. I'll stop here again at the usual time. We'll meet you there. Forget the wagon. Follow those horses. Woodcutter's house. Guarded by bandits. Sada's cousins. He must be hiding there. We don't know that. But we will soon find out. Opses can't answer questions. There's someone in the house. I'll make them talk. Let me try first. <gasps> the husband is innocent. The Mongols killed your family. Where is he? I don't know. You're lying. She'll help us. And she can't stay here. I'll take her to my estate. She is going to kill me! No harm will come to you. Lady Masako, has the traitor's wife told you where he's hiding? Every time I ask, she starts crying and won't look at me. Can you blame her? I'm starting to. Maybe a young samurai will charm her. She's inside. <sighs> Wait here. Lady Masako plans to kill me. I can see it in her eyes. I won't let her hurt you. But I need your help. I have told you all I know. Hachi delivers messages for your husband. That means they have contact. It's only a matter of time until Masako finds them both. No, you have to save him. I can only do that if I get to him before she does. You know your husband. Where would he hide? Let me think. I'm giving her time to think about where he might be. What did you offer her? Let's take a walk. I know a place she won't hear us. There should be music. What? My grandchildren would make... Thank you. Leave me alone! Hina! Get to the house! Hachi, Sadao's brother. Why did you kill Hina? Tried to free her. She wouldn't leave. Wanted to save Sadao. She screamed for you. I, I didn't mean to. Where is your brother? I failed him. I won't betray him. You can't die! 
tell me where he is? He's gone. Hina died for nothing. She was murdered by traitors, just like my family. I can't give up the hunt. Map of supply routes. He delivered food to survivor camps. Maybe Sadao is hiding at one. Go to the nearest camp and talk to the monk in charge. He might know what the map reveals. What about you? I will bury Hina. I owe her that. I'll find you at the camp when I'm done. Junshi. I should have expected to find you here. How may I serve you, my lord? Do you know these lands well? I set up all of these camps. Does this map mean anything to you? Hmm. We give these to our wagon drivers who deliver food. They mark where the camps are so no one gets missed. Is that blood? Do you see anything that isn't one of your camps? I hear rumors of our own people killing each other in Ariake. Traitors are preying on innocent people. They murdered the women and children of Clan Adachi. You can help bring them to justice. This map shows Ariake's lighthouse. We have no camps there, but people have said bandits have taken it over. Not bandits. Something worse. Lady Masako has arrived. I think she prefers to speak with you. Headman of Kuta village might be at the lighthouse. Clan Adache built that for Ariake. This traitor has no shame. Sadao has men protecting him. There's no way they won't see us coming. Good. I want to give that traitor just enough time to fear what's coming. Let's go. You killed Hina! My brother! They died because of you! You should have died with your family! I wish I had! Damn you! You killed Sado. Masako. He helped kill everyone I loved. And for what? To satisfy his pathetic hatred? When the Mongols defeated the Samurai, I wanted to die with them. I threw myself into a battle I knew I couldn't win. It was... easier. With Sadao dead, whoever is responsible will hear that I'm alive and hunting. They'll become afraid, make a mistake. Just be careful, Masako. You too. You are a part of this now. The other traitors are somewhere in Toyotama. We'll find them together. Masako, what's wrong? A man named Kachiwara recruited the men who killed my family. His name is on the list. He lives in this prefecture. That monk knows where, but he won't tell me. Junshin means well. I'll talk to him. It's good to see you. And you, Lord Sakai. Lady Masako and I are looking for Kajiwara. You know where he is. She accused him of terrible things. I fear for his life if she finds him. Masako has good reason to believe he recruited the men who killed her family. Hmm. He would never do that. He is a humble fisherman, a loving husband and father. I think she is blinded by rage. Jushin, I need to talk to him. As long as it is just talking. Lady Masako! The Mongols attacked! My wife and daughter! Quiet, Snake! We know you killed them. Out of love. Better me than the Mongols. It's what they wanted. You sick shit! You recruited the assassins who killed them. I know is he understood. Understood what? How it feels to be ruined by you. How I was driven to poverty. The toll it took on my family. <laughs> 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 
couldn't stand to hear another word. Everything you said was a lie. Except about being ruined by me. I know Sadao felt the same way. The conspirators are bonded by hate. The attack on your clan was personal. Organized by a rival samurai with a deep grudge. But I can't think of who. We'll find him. We still have business in Toyotama. I'll find you when I know more. Thank you for your help, Jin. Masako. How long have you been here? Not long enough. You need some rest. What I need is justice for my family's murder. I'll be one step closer once I catch the snake named Umura. One of the conspirators on the list. He supplied the weapons that butchered my family. And we will find him and make him talk. Do you know what Omura looks like? I'm not sure. I haven't seen him in 20 years. You knew him? He supplied our clan, but he cheated us. Then tried to blame my husband for not paying him enough. Was he right? Of course not. Now please, watch the road and get comfortable. We might be here a while. Masako, there. Men on the walkway. They look just like him. Exactly like Omura 20 years ago. They must be his sons. Were they both involved? I'm taking the canyon. There are people I need to speak with. People you need to boast to. Excuse me? <sighs> Never mind. I'll see you in a movie. The one I followed was involved. He spoke of revenge against Clan Adachi. Then what are we waiting for? He's on his way to meet the man who hired him. The man who ordered my family murdered. Let's get closer. Hear what they're saying. I kept you waiting. Which one of you is Omura? That would be me. You have the payment? We do. No! Omura's mine! This was a setup. Whoever killed your family, lured Omura here to silence him. The coward is covering his tracks. Judging by this note, it's clear he's desperate for money. He must not lead a wealthy clan. Or oh, he has no clan at all. You think my family's killer isn't a samurai? Maybe he wants to become one. Start his own clan. And he's scavenging the corpse of Clan Adachi to fund it. Few people have the ambition for such a plot. I can use this. Narrow my search. First, get some rest. This hunt is killing you. Until I find the man responsible, there is no rest. I still have work to do in Kushi. Find me when you can. Junshin. What was that about? Lady Masako is looking for someone. She is angry I couldn't help. Like you helped with Kajiwara the fisherman? Did you ever find him? Yes. After he killed his wife and daughter. How could I be so foolish? My friend can be harsh, but she speaks the truth. This time, I truly do not know who she's after. You have nothing to fear. I'll speak with her. Thank you, Lord Sakai. And also for ridding this farmstead of Mongols. Now we can rebuild. These people are lucky to have you. Be well. Did the farmers know who you're looking for? Someone on the list. A thief. I'll help you find them. I need to handle it myself. The farmer said they left with armed men. Mercenaries. Professional killers. They could complicate things. I can use your help, but I need your discretion. I'm going to sell everything. I'm just waiting for the right time. Too late. He'll sell those heirlooms himself. Now take us to them. I'll pay you to leave them with me. <laughs> you have no money. I have this comb. It's gold with pearl inlay. That was a gift. It might fetch a fair price. No. It have our heads. Enough of this. Take us to the heirlooms. We don't need the mercenaries alive for questioning. Just her. The more of them we eliminate, the easier it'll be to recover what's yours. Just don't be seen or they might hurt her. Jin, I need to speak with Mai. I'm here if you need me. You stole my family's heirlooms for those murderers. How could you betray me? I didn't. You betrayed me. 
Turn me away. I saved you. My husband wanted you flogged. He knew. Then you should have left with me. I was the lady of Clan Adachi. And you were a thief. I still love you. Then tell me who you serve. He killed my family. And he'll kill me. I won't let him touch you. Jean, I want you to know I'm not... You don't owe me an explanation. I cared for my husband. But I cared for mine, too. You still do. I think I always will. The man we hunt has feelings for you. Other than my husband and my, I've had no romances, no admirers. He could have been lying, feigning sympathy to gather recruits. I just don't know who would do that. You'll keep searching. It's only a matter of time. When that time comes, we'll make him pay. I thought she was going to kill me. No harm will come to you. What do you know about Junshin? Junshin was helping survivors at Red Leaf Temple. But I hear the Mongols raided it. Then he's in danger. We will find him. What do you want with Junshin? He conspired to kill my family. He's been saving refugees. And his name wasn't on the list we found. Someone left him a note at the temple. It's identical to the ones the conspirators carried. Junshin was promised supplies for his relief camps. In return, he was to provide information on my whereabouts. It's just an offer. This proves nothing. It proves he had contact with the person who killed my family. We will get to the bottom of this by talking to Junshin. You have my word. He was last seen at Breadleaf Temple. Stand aside, Jin. You betrayed my family. Run! If we fight, the Mongols win. They already won. Give me your word. When I looked at Junshin, all I saw were my dead grandchildren. Their faces after being cut down. And you were protecting him. So you tried to kill me? Have you lost your mind? I have lost everything! No. You've sacrificed everything. For revenge. And what do you feel when you think of Juzo? Can't let anger consume us. Or blind us to our friends. You still trust me? Junshin won't get far. We can track him down. Masako! Don't ever try to kill me again. I won't. I promise. Who offered you supplies in exchange for information about Masako? She called herself L Lady Hana. Liar! Masako, wait. Who is Lady Hana? My sister. She was massacred with the rest of my family. She visited me two nights ago 
wore a crimson kimono with a golden sash. I remember. She smelled of chrysanthemum. No. No. I never told her anything about you. I swear it. Leave us. My sister's alive. She murdered the children. Why would she want to destroy your clan? I don't know. But I am going to find her. You don't have to do it alone. Meet me in Kamiyagata. You've been praying. To my ancestors. Asking forgiveness for what I'm about to do. What do they say? I can't hear them. Perhaps your ancestors are silent because they can't do what you must. I know where my sister is. Clan Kikuchi's old fort. Then you're ready? I have no incense left to burn. No more prayers to make. Little sister, you let me think I buried you. Who was it, really? A peasant woman killed by the Mongols. Did you weep for me? You have taken everything! Daughters and grandchildren. Not nearly enough. The Mongols robbed me of Adachi's death. And you cheated yours. But finally, I will take everything. Kill them. You murdered my children, my grandchildren, destroyed my family. A small price to pay for what you've done. I have done nothing. You stole everything, drove me from our home, took the life that was rightfully mine, left me with that abusive drunk in this frozen land. None of that is my fault. It is! And damn you for acting as if it isn't! You've come to kill me! So finish this! It will be your only kindness! I can't end your suffering. But you can. Now, you have nothing! <laughs> 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 I've mourned my family. I've tried to honor them, meditate on treasured memories, but she consumes them. Even now, I have nothing left. No. You've accomplished what you set out to do. You have honored your family, given them justice. Now you can find peace. This path does not lead to peace. Where does it lead? I don't know. I have to continue walking it to find out. I don't want you to go. You must. But I will be there when you need me. Masako! What are you doing here, Masako? Looking for my family. I already found my husband, but I've yet to find my sons. They died as warriors, defending our home. 
Did you see where they fell? No. The battle was chaos. I could barely keep eyes on my uncle. Let me help you find them. One of your soldiers? Yes. But alone. Do you think he deserted? When your husband fell, your clan surged forward to avenge their lord. No one fled. It's a comfort to know they were loyal to the end. Chicago. A close friend of my son's. He would have stayed by their side. Shigesato! Yasanari! Strung up like an Let's get them down. They should be with our family. Buried beside their wives and children. The journey to Ariake isn't safe. Is there some place close we could bury them that would honor their sacrifice? The lighthouse. They played there when they were young. But it's been overrun by Mongols. Then we take it back. I never let them spend the night here. Even when they grew older. I always called them home. That's what I missed most after my mother passed. A voice calling for me. Take comfort in knowing she is at peace. They all are. Kenji, what are you doing here? Something has gone very wrong, my lord. What did you do? Nothing! The Mongols have taken all our food. Rice, millet, fish, anything they can lay hands on. We're starving. You say we. This isn't your farm. I have been thinking about what you said. And I'm trying to help the farmers here. Where are the Mongols camped? Who knows, they show up every few days and pick up the food and cart it away. I could ambush them. It's not that simple. They've taken hostages. If we don't produce the food, it's... <gasps> there must be a way to find them. There is. You won't like it. I will decide that for myself. Your plan is to anger the Mongols more? Not exactly. The barrel is very roomy. It could hold a heavily armed heroic samurai. You know what would fit better? A flabby, flexible sake merchant. The Mongols will take the barrel to the heart of their camp. Who could do more good there? Me or you? It smells like your breath in here, Kenji. Well, that barrel didn't empty itself. Get ready, my lord. Here they come. Udigen uh, Yes, yes, all yours. Take, take. Master Morigov. No, no, no. Uh, that's Miko. Uh, Miko is my horse. Mine. Nadamatat. Morbignich Borso. Ow. You can't do this. Miko, no. Take this food back to your farm. Give Kenji the good news. Kenji? Why would I give him anything but a punch in the mouth? What do you mean? He's the idiot who got us into this mess. He tried to cut a deal with the Mongols. Oh, Lord Sakai! That was amazing. Kenji! You suck his swilling piece of monkey dung! I'll handle this. You didn't think the Mongols would notice? Not so quickly. All of a sudden, it was... Punishment, hostages, give us food or we kill you. I was wrong to encourage you to make yourself useful. What? No, 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 you weren't wrong, Lord Takai. I can do good. I just need practice. Try not to practice when people's lives are at stake. Yes, my lord. Kenji, what are you doing? You have stumbled on a perfect opportunity, my lord. Down this road lies an enemy camp 
stuffed with supplies to feed, clothe, and heal dozens, hundreds, and the Mongols left! <laughs> it's a ripe plum just begging for it! What are you not telling me? This is a simple situation. No Mongols, lots of stuff. Help ourselves, help the people. <laughs> <sighs> On the slim chance some good comes of this. Lead the way. I knew you'd understand, Lord Sakai. Kenji! I'll kill you! Who are you? The man who's going to end Kenji's life. You left me here to die. No, not true! I brought help! Meet Lord Sakai, also known as the Ghost. One of you explain what's happening, now. Kenji set me up is what's happening. It wasn't a setup. The Mongols were supposed to pay for this stuff, only they didn't. And then... They took my friend Nato here hostage. They were supposed to pay for this? Thank you, Lord Sakai. Yes, thank you! You know what happens now. <laughs> I'm going to ride that Sakai barrel all the way to- Kenji, I think he's angry. Lord Sakai, our intention was always to gift our gains to the survivors who need it most. The camp outside the town of Yarikawa. Gather everything you can, and when I visit that camp, I'm going to find it overflowing with food and medicine, correct? Yes, my lord. Yes, my lord. Lord Sakai! My prayers have been answered. That remains to be seen. What's wrong, Kenji? Uh, I owe money to a bandit, um, Gon the Butcher. Then you should pay him. I will. I will, but uh, he wants to meet me in the middle of nowhere so he can cut my throat. What did you do to deserve that? He paid for a delivery of sake and medicine, and I might have skimmed some to help survivors fleeing Izuhara, and didn't think he'd notice. <laughs> there are better ways to help people, Kenji. My lord, I'm an idiot. And you want me to clean up your mess. Couldn't you just watch from the shadows in case Gon tries anything? If you scare him off, he'll just put a price on my head. Your intentions this time were better than usual. I will help. Thank you, my lord. Go to the bridge. I'll find a spot with a clear view of Gong. All right. And if anything goes wrong, I'll signal you. I'll shout, I'm so happy to see you! As you wish. That's really funny. Keep laughing and I'll take your tongue. I'm so happy to see you! What? I'm so happy to see you! He knows! I'm so happy to see you! I owe you my life, Lord Sakai. You owe me more than that. Whatever you want. A sake, a saddle polish, a nice... Kenji, why risk your life over trifles? Not trifles. I need food, money, a warm fire. You helped me save Taka. That was heroic, wasn't it? You have a talent, Kenji. It's time you use it for the sake of our island. Of course. Honor is my specialty. I didn't expect to find you here. I'd leave if I could. Who did this? Mongol warlord, Altan. I heard stories coming out of Otsuna. He's terrorizing everyone, stealing food, medicine, slaughtering families. If anyone fights back or tries to run, they get butchered, like animals. An old friend of mine runs the Ian down the road. I can't leave her with them. We'll find your friend, and put an end to this warlord. Ichi, you're alive. Why are you here? We came to save you. You've killed me, Yuna. You were working with the Mongols to survive. You should have fought back. And you should have run away. 
like you always do. She risked her life to save you. Do yourself a favor, my lord. Keep away from that one. Ichi, we can protect you from Altan. Just tell me where to find him. No one knows where he is. Not even his men. But if you really want his attention... Tell me. Find his most valued allies. The Japanese slavers who do his bidding. Make an example of them. And Altan will find you. Who are these slavers? Ask Yuna. She'll remember. I don't know what happened between you in the past. But she only wants to help. Yuna had her chance. Not enough. If we want to draw Altan out of hiding, we have to earn his attention. The Ghost can manage that. Where do we start? We hurt Altan's closest allies. Japanese slavers. The Mamashi brothers. Ichi said you know them. I bet she did. Those three bastards run up far up near the river. When you're ready, meet me there. We'll do this together. I will. Looks like a fortress. The Mamashi brothers don't want anyone to see what goes on behind those walls. They're running a slave camp. You've been inside. Taka and I are the only ones who ever escaped. When were you imprisoned here? A lifetime ago. Taka and I were still children. Do you remember what happened? Every moment. Kichizo's beatings. The stink of Manzo's breath. And Taizo's filthy little hands. If we kill them, we'll send a message to the master. Draw Altan out of hiding. I can't do this. I just... I can't go back in there. You don't have to. Stay here. I will deliver your vengeance. Make them suffer, Jin. Taka. For every scar they gave us. For every head they collected from the tired workers who just asked for more water. Make them suffer for me. I can repay their cruelty and take their heads. That won't be enough. Not after Altan pushed them to this. I will kill them where they sleep, without being seen. Show Altan that no one is beyond the reach of the ghost. The Mongols won't sleep for a week. Do it. If the Mongol forces, we could overtake the main road. Don't be your head for your cruelty. You deserve worse. Now for your head. I'll take your head. Leave the rest for the insects. They'll never take another slave. Tell me they suffered. Not as much as they deserved. But all of Ortsuna will know what became of them. All the horrible things they did. For years. And I knew. But I never did anything. You can do something now. It's time we sent Altan a message. Written in blood and covered in flies. Let's draw the Mongols out. Send our message. I want to watch. We'll hide in the tall grass. I'll get their attention. What is it? A child's doll. Stained in blood. The black wolf enslaves children? Yes. Then he sells them to the Mamushi brothers. Where is he? His camp's down this path, but it's crawling with Mongol guards. Then they will die with him. I need to be the one to kill the Black Wolf. I had a chance a long time ago. But I... I couldn't. I can help you. 
We'll attack head on. Let him know we're coming. I want him to feel helpless. Paralyzed. He will. And by the time we're finished, Baltan will feel the same. Coward likely fled. He can't get away. Wait. That Mongol ship offshore. He may be inside. You enslaved children! No, I... You've done it for 20 years! You held me and Taka captive. Sold us to the Mamushi slave farm. Taka. He was my favorite. But the way I remember it, you brought him to me. I didn't know. You know, he's yours. <laughs> Tan will see this and know we're coming. He'll be forced to act. Jin. What the Black Wolf said was the truth. What do you mean? I asked if I could bring my brother. He got us drunk. And then... Taka doesn't remember, but I do. I was frozen. I could have killed him, saved Taka. But I was too scared. It's not your fault. Because of you, he'll never hurt another child. I need some time. I'm going back to the inn. I'll we'll see you there. What happened? Altan got a message. This was his answer. He said to meet him at a camp near the Kushi border. He'll pay for this. We will bring him to justice. You've brought nothing but death. It is our duty to exact revenge. We'll take it from Altan or die trying. That's the duty of a samurai. Yuna's just a thief. And thieves have no honor. We'll make this right. I swear. Your promises are just like you. Worthless. Let's get the horses. Altan. With another pack of dogs. Altan. Face judgment for your crimes. You cannot judge me. You murdered your own people. The Mamushi brothers and the Black Wolf are traitors. Is that your excuse? Your reason to become the ghost and kill him? No wonder the straw hat Ryuzo turned on you. Enough! It's time to finish this. You killed Altan, but our people know what you did to the others. Now they're afraid the ghost will come for them next. Good people have nothing to fear from me. What do you believe, Ichi? Are we monsters? I think you did what you had to. Goodbye, Yuna. Don't let what Ichi said bother you. I don't want our own people afraid of me. You can't expect everyone to understand what you're doing. 
Well, why? No. But I wonder if I've crossed the line. If we have, we are on the right side of it. Hochi and his followers came down from Cedar Temple to train healers in the village. Mongols kidnapped them. They took nothing else? Hochi went peacefully, so they spared the village. Slaughter those who resist, reward submission. Cotton's favorite tactic. He should not have gone along with them. He gave himself up for the village. The Mongols will be back. All he did was delay the end. Then it's a good thing you and I are here. Came this way, past the tea fields. Look for tracks. Are you the samurai who rose from the dead? Is Hochi with you? Hochi? No, but one of us broke loose. The invaders chased after him. They'll be back any moment. Road Sakai! Mongols up the road! Norio? You're alive! Stay back, all of you. Is anyone hurt? We're all right, my lord. Where is Hochi? A different group took him. Norio, they knew Hochi's name. And they mentioned Sira Temple. Why would they separate Hochi from the rest? He's the most skilled healer. They might have plans for him. He also likes to argue. You think he angered them? Knowing Hochi? Yes. Don't jump to conclusions. First, we need to track him down. Give me time to figure out where the Mongols took him. I'll meet you at Akashima village. We'll find him, Norio. We've all been worried about Hochi. They need a break. Such moments are rare these days. I used to be like them. I'm not the same man I was the night before Komoda. How bad was it? Komoda? Bad. We lost everyone. The beach was soaked with so much blood, it was like... paste. Be grateful you didn't see it. We rode south all day, into the night. A bad storm slowed us to a crawl. Stopped at a farm to sleep a few hours. I woke to screams. The main house on fire. Mongol raiders. They took us to Canada in chains. After that, I wish I had died fighting. I think I know where they took Hochi. You want to go now? Yes. What's happening? Who are you? Friend, we need to go. I can't leave. The Mongols are returning me to see the temple. The people there need healers. Badly. There's no time for this. I'm sorry, but I must remain here. Jin! Hochi! Norio? What are you doing here? The alarm drew a raiding party nearby. They're almost on us. Damn it. Stay back, Hochi. We won't let them near you. Norio, ready your blade. Everyone is gone. It's just me now. I'm sorry. I wish we could end this bloodshed. The Mongols were searching for me. I gave myself up to save lives. How did they know where to find you? They knew I was an Akashima. And they wanted to return me to see the temple. They need a healer. You're willing to treat the enemy's wounded? Mongol or Japanese, we all suffer. Some deserve it. But this means... the Cedar Temple fallen? I don't know. Norio, take Hochi back to the village before reinforcements arrive. They will seek revenge. I'll meet you there to plan a defense. 
What's the problem? Mongols are gathering nearby, preparing to strike. We should evacuate to Castle Canada. Evacuate and the Mongols will hunt you down. Not one of you will live to see Canada's walls. But we won't have blood on our hands. Go tell the village your plan for them, Hochi. I'd like to see that. <sighs> Norio, I wish you cared about the Eightfold Path more than others' opinions. First you follow Enjo around, now Lord Sakai. Do you ever think for yourself? Wash my brother's name from your mouth. Enough! Norio and I will do the fighting. Everyone else can go hide. I refuse to hide. I don't take lives. But I am not a coward. Take them to the temple. I won't let you fight alone. If the Mongols go to the temple, who will protect these people? I'll do as you ask. Keep your Naginata ready. I'll owe you a jar of sake for putting up with Hochi. What happened, Norio? I was fighting. A Mongol snuck up behind me. Hochi threw himself at a blow meant for me. You're both braver than many samurai I've known. I didn't know he was behind me until I heard him cry out. By the time I turned around, he was dead. It's not your fault. Norio? Every time they lifted the cover on the pit, the daylight would blind us. This time, one of them stank like sake. I felt their hands pull me up, but my brother threw himself at them. He was starving, wounded, but he fought them. He fought them so hard. Norio. You don't have to. Yes, I do. They gave up on me and took Enjo. They took my brother. Everyone who rode south from Cedar Temple. All gone. Except me. They deserve to live. I'm the one who should be dead. I thought the same thing after Komodo. Many times. I don't know why we survived, Norio. But we did. And these people are counting on us. We're all they have. The people of Akashima are alive because of you. Don't forget that. Because they won't. My lord, look what they've done! Kushidera Temple deserves reverence, not bloodshed. Centuries of wisdom lie within those walls, and the Mongols were ready to torch it all to the ground. They attacked for a reason. The temple gives people hope. The abbot's been telling people to pray for a great storm to wash the invaders from our home. Now the abbot's missing, and the brutes stole the most sacred relic in Toyotama, a statue of Buddha carved at the temple's founding. My brother would have recovered then. He would have given these monks hope before they ran for the hills. And we honor his memory and restore the temple. The Mongols stole the statue of Buddha from the main hall. And the abbot? He and his closest followers fled. I'm hoping they found shelter. The abbot is from Cedar Temple. Why did he come here? To help resist the Mongols in Toyotama. But when they attacked, he escaped. The battle was chaotic. Might be difficult to track them. There's a farm nearby that supports the temple. We'll start there. Is it... The abbot? The bastards love their fire, don't they? He's not the abbot. Just one of his followers. Keep searching. Is he? I'm sorry, Norio. Without his leadership, the monks will leave. And the temple will fall. The Mongols won. 
What's that next to him? A Lotus Sutra, written in the abbot's blood. His final act, like a samurai's death poem. The point of this sutra is that we can all be Buddhas, from the lowest peasant to the greatest noble, written with his dying breath. Not for himself, but for those he left behind. Show the sutra to the monks. If they see the abbot's devotion, they might stay. And this is the sutra the abbot wrote in his own blood. A final act of devotion. A call to stand up to cruelty. A call to stay and not surrender. We will honor the abbot's sacrifice, Norio. We must not let Kushi Temple fall. Enjo the Guardian saved us once. Now his brother and Lord Sakai have saved us again. And together we can defeat the Mongols. The statue is here. Yes, my lord. The Mongols stole our sacred Buddha and rode off toward the coast. We'll return the statue and save this temple. Not even your brother could keep that promise, Norio. What was that about? My brother fell to a Mongol blade. Enjo the Guardian dies, and these monks are willing to give up everything. They're cowards. They're people. Enjo feared nothing. He wasn't even 20 when he saved this temple from bandits. Now it's up to us. What happened? I was following the Mongols. I begged them to give back our Buddha. Where did they go? Out of the forest. To the hills. Carved from a star that fell from the heavens centuries ago. Beautiful. There's nothing else like it on the island. Let's get it back to the temple. Enjo became the guardian when bandits attacked the temple. They came for this statue. It's priceless. Probably survived many such attempts. How many more people have to die protecting it? You want to let it be stolen? No. But the temple is filled with treasures. It provokes greed and envy. Lord Shimura brought me to see it when I was a boy. I was sure the sculptor must have met the Buddha in person. When I was a boy, my family traveled here to make an offering for the new year. That's when Enjo and I decided to become monks. I used to know what I fought for. We fight for a home. Maybe so. Have you spoken with the monks? Their resolve is growing, but they still fear the Mongols. As they should. Where is everyone? At the river, bathing, washing clothes. Who's that coming to the temple? Look, a Mongol who wants to die. He's alone. See what he wants first. The ghost and the brother of the guardian. I have a message for you. Speak. The ghost and the monks have defied the Khan's will. Surrender, and we spare this place. Refuse, and all will burn. We will never surrender. Then you will die. The monks by the river. They don't have time to reach shelter. Then we'll be their shelter. I can't. The Buddha, the Abbot Sutra. Are they worth more than the monks' lives? I can't save them alone. Centuries of learning reside in this temple. I can't let it burn. But you'll let the monks burn. I will die for this temple. Do what you have to. Then stay here. I'll find the monks at the river and bring them back. Norio, what are you doing? The temple's undefended. Temples can be rebuilt. Lives can't. We'll defend the monks at the pagoda. Lead the way!
Mongols lost badly here. They won't be eager to return. The monks will never forget what you did for them. I didn't fight alone, Norio. No, but if I had not listened to you, many more would be dead. What will you do now? It's time I return to see the temple. We still need your Naginata to drive the invaders from our home. You'll have it. And my temple will be a strong ally to you in the north. I'll join you there. My brother earned the name Guardian when he saved this temple. I wish we could have saved the statue. The statue's final lesson. Save what we can, but know that everything passes away. It's a worse statue when it's broken, but a better teacher. <laughs> you are praising the Mongols. Do they pay well for your services? If they refuse, they kill us. But the Guardian's brother will change that. What do you know about Norio? He's going to lead us to victory. I can take you to him. You think these people can take back the temple? We could handle it on our own. Why risk their lives? Cedar Temple can be a beacon for all of Tsushima. Everyone who takes part in the attack will be a messenger of hope. We can't carry this message alone. This victory has to be theirs. When do we ride, Norio? At dawn, my lord. It's good to have Kushi Temple with us. Cedar Temple, Akashima, and Kushi stand together as one. You'll attack through the main gate? Yes. Draw the Mongols' attention while the others flank. Where do you want me? My lord, this may be my plan, but you should fight as you see fit. All of you, follow me. Stay close. Temple is yours. The last time I was here, my brother, Hochi, the abbot, they were all alive. Starting today, you can rebuild. Come with me to the main hall. I have to make sure the Mongols did no lasting damage. Nothing damaged or stolen. <laughs> Norio. Angel? I thought... The Mongols promised to spare you. If I told them everything... I'm here, Enjo. It's all right now. <laughs> I told them about the Abbey. Ochi. Kuchi Tera. In Akashima. It doesn't matter. <laughs> The one who burned my brother and cut off his limbs. This Haricho is among the dead? Not yet. Norio, your brother was the guardian. He died a hero. No, he didn't. I can find out where this Mongol coward is. But then I'll need your help. You'll have it. When the snow lets up, we'll hold the funeral. I'm looking for Norio. Where is he? He brought his brother's ashes to a cemetery. It's in the hills to the south. I'll look for him there. Thank you. Enjo's urn. He liked the open air better than the pagoda at Cedar Temple. 
The Mongol you're looking for, Harucho. Have you found him? He's not far from here. Norio, Sira Temple needs your leadership. This comes first. Revenge is not the first duty of a monk. Before I was a monk, I was a brother. Don't do this alone. Let me help. If you wish, advance and reach Nirvana. Retreat and find hell. What's that from? A prayer Enjo inscribed on this Naginata after he saved Kushi Temple from bandits and became the guardian. He suffered more than either of us know, but he held on so he could see you. Do you know what his last words to me were? I was wrong. About what? I'll never know. Karsho's last words will be a howl of pain. We should get some rest, Norio. For tomorrow. You're right, my lord. I'll save my strength for Karsho. Once told me you would never swing your Naginata in hatred. I did what the ghost would do. And now Harsho is gone. I'm not going back to see the temple. Not after this. Where will you go? It doesn't matter. He was still alive when I lit the wood. When he screamed, it filled me with joy, and I would do it again. I'm no longer a monk. You don't get to give up. We all have regrets and broken promises. But this island needs you, the last warrior monk of Cedar Temple. was before this. I'm not asking you to go back. I'm asking you to keep your faith and move forward. Thank you, Jin. Young master, would you like something to eat? I'm fine, Yuriko. I just need the poison. You are trying to remember the ingredients. They were flowers. You remember them, don't you? The ones I planted at your family cemetery. I remember washing the graves. Father made me haul buckets of water from the lake. He knew it would make you strong and teach you to respect your ancestors. Don't you remember the flowers, Jin? Spider lilies. That's right. It's safe to look for the spider lilies. Why would we look for them here? Isn't this where you used to plant them? Oh, uh, no, not here. Oh, it's been so long. They're in another cemetery. Your great aunt's branch of the family. It's not Achoo. far. Some of my favorite memories happened at this lake. Stopping a child's visiting? Your mother and I would come here when she was pregnant with you. We should keep moving. <laughs> A grown man, and you still can barely sit still. We can meditate again, after the war. Yes, young master. This is all I could find. It is enough to make the poison, but I don't want our time to end. The Shimura Cemetery isn't far. With a view of the waterfall. Let's go, my lord. We should return to Omi. I'll stay a while. I know better than to argue. Good. You learned something today. Kazumasa used to say Lord Shimura was too concerned with that castle. 
The strongest point on the island. He equated strength with the, the huge, the immovable, like a mountain. He had a point. Doubt and indecision have destroyed armies. In the midst of battle, true leaders must stay rooted, stand firm. But look at that waterfall. All that immovable rock yields to water. The strength we need is all around us. <coughs> Excuse me. The cold wind is getting to me. Yuriko, you're not well. Nonsense. Let me take you to Akashima. They can treat you. We have to visit someplace special. Where? It's not far. After that, I promise we will see your healers. Fine. But if you start feeling worse, we go straight to Akashima. Of course, my lord. Always so stern. Isn't it beautiful? Very. Why are we here? Are you upset? I hope it's not wrong of us to come. I don't understand. Oh, it's so painful to see you weighed down by sadness with Lady Sakai and the little one. Yuriko, are you all right? It's nothing. I just felt a little faint. When did you last eat? Yesterday, I think. Wait here. I'll find us something. I'm not a child. Please, Yuriko. Rest here a moment. As you wish. Since you ask so sweetly. I'll be back soon. Yuriko, are you hurt? No. I was just... I got lost. Where were you going? I saw my mother. She waved but kept walking. I had to catch up. I'm bringing you home. No. My mother. I have to make an offering. You do not. Please, for all the times I've done as you asked, come with me. Let me pay respects to my mother. All right. But don't push yourself. Oh, Kazumasa. That night, you brought little Jin to me. When he was so sick after all that time in the forest. We had already lost Lady Sakai. Kazumasa, are you listening? I'm listening. I made him drink that remedy my mother taught him. We sat by his side the whole night. You held my hand. Do you remember? Yes, I remember. That night, I was so scared. So sad for little Jin. But I was so happy. Does that make me a bad person? No. When he recovered, when you taught me how to ride, the day we rode to the onset, Sunset was red and full. That was... 
That was what? The best day of my life. <gasps> now tell me what you see. Yuriko? Rest, Yuriko. The strength we need is all around us. The mighty fall at last to be no more than dust before the wind.